With me now is Lisa Burke, a former Young Entre Entrepreneur of the Year who is now Sales Director of the Catalogue retail Retailer Cleanies. Good morning to you, morning. Lisa. Um, what do you think about what Art is saying there? Do you think he's been too fussy by not taking any job? Well, you know, I think, you know, if you look at my company, Clean Easy, there's huge opportunities um, out there. At the, at the moment, we're seeing a sevenfold increase in the number of youngsters that are joining our business um, as, uh, as a self-employed distributor. And we're looking at a double uh, increase in our numbers by twice the amount that we currently have. And the opportunities are tremendous out there right now. So do, do you think they're being um, fussy or not? Do you think well, the, the young people that are coming to you, are they quite enthusiastic and up for anything? Um, absolutely. We're, we're, we're seeing the trend growing um, and the message is getting out there. I don't think we can underestimate the um, social media and the way that people are communicating, the youngsters are communicating and we're finding now that people are saying, yes, we do need to look at alternatives. We can't all take the perf perfect dream job um, and um, we're, we're offering those opportunities in the marketplace right now. It's interesting how many comments and uh, views we've had on this people have sent into us. I just want to tell you a couple of them. Simon Simon Carter on Twitter says um, he's recruiting for a high quality apprentice role last week. Uh, planned to interview eight young people, but only three turned up. Very sad. Um, there is this problem, isn't there, that the, the reputation that young people have at the moment is that they are a bit lazy when it comes to work because they're looking for that dream role which maybe might not be out there at the moment. Yeah, there's always, you know, there's always going to be a group of that type of individual. Um, what we're finding actually is the message is getting out loud and clear that you actually need to look at alternatives and that's what we, we're able to provide um, through Clean Easy. So we're, you know, we're very focused on ensuring that people realise there are alternatives, there are ways that you can make money and have a great income um, and not necessarily, you know, go down the traditional route. Do you think um, young people are prepared for the world of work when they come to you? Uh, not always. Um, one of our um, big uh, pluses is that we mentor people very closely through people that have been there, they've done the walk, they've done the talk, and um, they're not already, always ready. And we can ob obviously offer them a, a real, some real life skills, uh, and people really expand their their knowledge and their skill base. And I certainly, as an employer, would really see it as an advantage on somebody's CV mm. if they'd had if they've really had the get up and go and work ethic to go and go out and do something mm. for themselves. What was the first job you ever had? Well, I actually started in direct sales at the age of 19. Um, I was training to be an accountant and I stayed in, in the industry uh, mm. 25 years later. I saw an opportunity and I saw a fantastic industry where, where I could build my own business and create an income and change my life. There um, you go then. So, yeah, so Quite it's fantastic to then. be able to offer that to other people. Okay, thanks very much for your time. Uh, my first job, if you want to know. I was, I was going to ask. I worked for Claire's Accessories and uh, as well as selling earrings and the like, I was also an ear...